Good morning, class four three. Mr. Waterman here today with your morning lesson slash story. Today is Thursday, October twenty second, two thousand and twenty, and I hope everyone is safe and well. So, in front of me, I have my book of fables, which I started reading to you yesterday when I read the Bad Kangaroo. Uh, today, I want to read, of course, a different fable. And before I get to that, what I want you to remember is that fables, they are stories where the animals are main characters. These are stories that teach us a very, very important lesson that we should remember for many days. Okay, now I'm going to pick out one of my favorites to you here. I'll show you the picture first. You can see a mouse sitting on top of a large rock at the beach. Okay, what do you think he's looking at? Why do you think he's looking at it? Let's find out. The mouse at the seashore. A mouse told his mother and father that he was going on a trip to the seashore. We are very alarmed, they cried. The world is full of terrors. You must not go. I have made my decision, said the mouse firmly. I have never seen the ocean, and it is high time that I did. Nothing can make me change my mind. Then we cannot stop you, said Mother and Father Mouse. But do be careful. The next day, in the first light of dawn, the mouse began his journey. Even before the morning had ended, the mouse came to know trouble and fear. A cat jumped out from behind a tree. I will eat you for lunch, he said. It was a narrow escape for the mouse. He ran for his life, but he left a part of his tail in the mouth of the cat. By afternoon, the mouse had been attacked by birds and dogs. He had lost his way several times. He was bruised and bloodied. He was tired and frightened. At evening, the mouse slowly climbed the last hill and saw the seashore spreading out before him. He watched the waves rolling onto the beach, one after another. All the colors of the sunset filled the sky. How beautiful, cried the mouse. I wish that mother and father were here to see this with me. The moon and the stars began to appear over the ocean. The mouse sat silently on the top of the hill. He was overwhelmed by a feeling of deep peace and contentment. The moral of this story, all the miles of hard road are worth a moment of true happiness. And just like I tell my students every day, if something is difficult, never give up. You can do it. What a beautiful fable. That's all for this morning. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a comment in the contact form. I look forward to hearing from you all very soon. Stay safe and well. Thank you. Bye-bye.